so hello everyone in this video we'll be creating our blogs uh, schema so let's do that first of all let me just tell you that uh, this database uh, connection that I created will be specifically used for this project and after finishing this tutorial I'll be de deleting this project and the database from the MongoDB atlas so you have to create your own uh, connection strings just like I uh, like told you in the last video so you have to follow that uh, to create this kind of string so it will be unique for your project that's what I wanted to tell you so a schema is basically uh, the structure of our document in which we'll be storing our data basically a blog what will be the fields inside that so that will be specifying using mongoose so for that we'll be uh, creating a simple folder which will contain all the models so models is basically uh, uh, the main folder in which uh, we can uh, create different schema files and we can specify that so if I let's say create a blog schema blog.model.js so that is basically uh, the thing so first of all I'll be importing uh, the mongoose package so let me just import that we can simply use require mongoose and we can create a mongoose schema for blog let's say schema and then we can specify new keyword and from mongoose also you can import uh, or basically destructure the schema method from mongoose and you can directly use schema otherwise you can use uh, mongoose dot schema and then you can also use that here what we have to do is we have to specify uh, the key key value pairs that we'll be using so first we'll be using title and inside that we'll be specifying what type of it will be having type will be string and I'll be specifying required as true and then we have a description and I can simply copy it and yeah we can do that and we can specify author so let's just create uh, these three fields only and after that we uh, in the second parameter we can specify timestamps as true so what uh, the timestamps will do uh, mongoose will automatically add the created at and uh, updated at uh, fields in the document itself whenever we'll be creating any new uh, collection uh, collection document then in that collection it will automatically add those fields created at and the time at which uh, the particular document is created and uh, the updated at field whenever anything is updated in that document so in timestamps I can set it as true and then uh, what we can do is we can import them uh, like export this blog model and I can specify it like this export const blog and here I can specify mongoose sorry mongoose dot model and then we can specify the name of this model let's name it blog and then we can specify the schema which is blog schema now this is created now in the next video we'll be making use of this block schema and testing it out whether the data is there in our mongodb atlas or not let me just first save it yep that's it now in the next video we'll be testing it out thank you for watching let's meet in the next video